Oh, they got me left. The lag's gonna kill me one day. I gotta figure that out. I don't know what causes it. Don't forget to subscribe, guys. It means so much. Thanks. Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Miles here. Today, I'm going to be helping you solve an issue where your computer will stutter for just a split second, maybe a couple seconds, and you'll notice it, especially when you're gaming, which is even more frustrating. I've personally been dealing with this for months. I've been searching everywhere online, and I couldn't find... I found a ton of advice, but I couldn't find the solution, and I finally freaking figured it out, so I had to make this video just in case this helps, like, one or two people. I'd be, it's worth making the video because you know how it is searching online, looking at all these videos, all these forums, and you're like, dude, none of this works for me. So I'm going to show you the step-by-step -step process. It's super simple, uh, luckily, um, that I went through to solve this issue. But just in case you don't have the exact cause, I'm also going to be showing you how I found what was causing it. So just in case it's not the same exact thing that's causing your problem, you should be able to find out what is. Before we get started, if this video helps you, don't forget to leave that like, comment, and let me know that this solved your issue because that's super awesome. And uh, it kind of tells other people like, hey, maybe I should try this. <laughs> so uh, yeah, without further ado, let's start off by showing the actual problem so you can determine if this is your issue. Before you get started on these troubleshooting steps, we have to confirm that you're experiencing the same issue that I am, or that I was, luckily. <laughs> um, it's just a random lag that happens. It's like a lag spike, and it locks up your game for an instant. And if you're in the middle of like an FPS, that can be the difference between winning your match for your team and getting yelled at by your team. So it's super important. So check this out. It's about to happen. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. It's, it was about to happen, but okay. I'm doing circles, okay? And the reason why I'm doing circles is because, <laughs> because if I stand still, I can't tell the lag spike. Um, but, <laughs> sorry, I'm just, I'm recording this video. It's cracking me up. Sorry, we gotta focus. You're pissed off at your computer. Okay, here we go. It's gonna lag. There you go, look at that, all right? So, if you're having an issue like that, it's just a, a random lag spike and then it's good, then you're in the right place, okay? The second step to confirm you're in the right place is to time the intervals between these lag spikes and see if there's a pattern. So the second you spike, start a stopwatch, and then when it happens again, stop the stopwatch, okay? Well, actually do it like twice, so do a lap or whatever. So time it a few times to see if there's a pattern, a consistent pattern. And what that's gonna indicate is that it should be program related. So now that you've done that, I'm gonna show you how to find out what's causing the issue. Now, the first thing you're gonna wanna do is open resource monitor. And if for the sake of this troubleshooting, you need to run your, your games in a windowed mode, okay? So if you're normally running in full screen, switch it to windowed mode just to troubleshoot. And that way you can have this menu off to the side. Now keep in mind when it's off to the side, it's gonna be much smaller. So, you know, you can read it, but you need to be focused on your disc section, okay? And you need to expand it out so you can see two things. Well, you don't really need to see, so we're gonna be sorting by total, okay? So we can see like, what's doing the most work, what has the most activity, and then we need to expand the file path out so we can see what's going on. That's the main thing you need to be able to see is the file path, okay? So once you have it sorted by total uh, read slash write, you can kind of expand that out if it goes off the screen when you're in windowed mode while you're gaming, so you can identify. or you know, if, it, if it's noticeable in another scenario, like you're watching videos, then you can, you know, have that off to the side. Just don't be in full screen mode for the sake of troubleshooting. Now, one thing to note is that in order to monitor the disk section when the lag occurs to identify the issue, you'll likely need a screen recording software. And if you don't have access to that, what you can also do is set up your phone to record your monitor. 
the reason why is because it happens really quick and it's going to be virtually impossible for you to sit there and say oh the lag happened and then look over and see what's changed because it, it it's really quick okay so let me show you my scenario when i had my resource monitor open and that let me identify my issue okay so now as we're watching this what we're looking at is the disk section and you can see what changes okay and we can see the culprit right there l connect 3 believe it or not lian lee what the hell are you doing with your crappy crappy software causing all these issues i mean you're a gaming company what the heck so in order to solve this all i had to do first i checked for an update i was like ah eh, it might just be like a bug that they knew of that was causing the issue and they've updated it nope lee and lee hasn't done anything okay <laughs> horrible they're they're i should have i don't know their software the l connect 3 like it's great for customizing the lights on the fans but once you have that set up you can close this program and there's it doesn't need to be running in the background so it's just really bad software um their their products are amazing their software is absolutely horrible and it's been causing this issue for me for months okay so if it's lee and lee let me know in the comments because we need to like band together and you know high five that we figured it out but <laughs> But also, if it's not Lee and Lee, you're like, what the hell is Lee and Lee? I don't have that. That's fine. Okay. Use this to identify what comes up in your disk list, what spikes, and you can see if that's your issue simply by closing it. Okay. Cause that's all that I had to do was close this program, you know, and like, here I am worried that something's overheating. I'm getting thermal throttled and all this stuff when it's simply poorly written software causing issues. After you follow these steps, go through another round with your timer and say like for me, it was every 14 minutes I would get that lag spike. So I played for like another hour and I got no lag spike. So do that and then come to the comments and let me know if it solved your issue. But I just really want to know if this video helped you guys because like when I have issues like this, I'm like, just pounding my head against the wall and then after i do that i'm like gosh i'm gonna hurt myself i gotta figure this crap out so if i helped you guys stop you know pounding your head against the wall it, it makes me happy honestly so with that said be sure to leave a like comment let me know uh sub if you haven't already if you've got an amazon prime you know sub on twitch you can drop me that it's free if you're on amazon prime you can just pop over to Twitch. I'll link it in the description. And then that way I get a couple dollars and I can feed my ducks. True. It's what I use. It's what I use money for. I crap for the ducks. And yeah. So that's it for me, guys. I will see you in the next one.